So guys, I'm very close. Uh, like you can see, that's Kingdom Kampala. Yeah, so thank you so much guys for those of you that contributed in. I had to walk. It's what it takes. Yeah, I pray we all overcome COVID. And uh, let's hope for the best. Yeah, so I'm at Centenary Park here. Walking towards the OPM offices. And uh, I'll show you guys a video when I'm there. I'll do that. So this is Lady Charlotte. Very empty. All shops closed. All shops closed. No business. Everybody is home. COVID-19. So I'm close, this is Kingdom Kampala, brand new building in Kampala here, that is Crescent Towers, so I'm very close to Parliament, if you guys can see that, deep at the back there, that's where I'm going. see here so I have to first stop clean my sweat a bit so I go and hand over a package yeah that's very tough moving in this period very very tough very very tough guys uh, okay uh, oh yeah yeah all right, catch you guys later. Just waiting here. Um, we've already got the paper. We're just waiting for the minister to come so we can be able to meet her. So that's what we're waiting for. Otherwise, we've already given in our donation. So you will bear with us, but you will be appreciated. Thank you so, so much. May God bless you abundantly, and where you are taking from, may he add more. So we'll begin, because uh, the first lady is coming in at four, and you know how to secure and so on. So I thought we shouldn't waste time, you already have waited for long, and trying to get the room vacated, then we'll start.
that the bedroom can be in. You will just announce who you are and what you have brought, and the media will capture you and will write you in the book, the golden book. There's even a silver one. Yeah. Thank you so much. So, guys, I met Awel. Uh, most of you know him, of course. Um, when it comes to communications on behalf of government and all those things. And he's the man actually that uh, helped out for the verification of uh, uh, my job. <laughs> it's part of my job. Yeah, but but uh, really, I just met this uh, brother of ours, the verification of our account is great. But what's more important is the contribution we got on the Twitter I've met of the 1.3 million. Yes, yeah, we didn't know about this campaign. So. And this year, we are definitely going to be part of the ongoing campaign to see how we can mobilize uh, support for vulnerable Ugandan communities. Um, yes, and like definitely we're actually going to do more because what I've realized, even when the lockdown, you know, is done, we still need to support people. No, people absolutely. still need support at least maybe until August, until this year ends. Yeah. So we're really going to put our hands together, but we appreciate the work you're doing. Thank you. And uh, regards to the entire team, you guys are doing an amazing job. Yeah. So a shout out for GCIC team. So yeah. Yes, I will. On. And I'll put this on YouTube. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Hey guys, we are done um, handing over our donation. So right now I'm just exiting. I'm just exiting the OPM up, uh, chambers. You can see in the back. Yeah, so thank you guys so much. And uh, let's keep doing this. Let's keep doing this. Let's, uh, let's support people. Let's support those that need some kind of hand. And guys, don't give up. Don't give up. Even if the lockdown goes down, go, you know, is uh, is, we still need to support those guys that need our help. So um, kindly don't give up. And uh, it's very important that we reach out to those that need our support. Yeah. So thank you so much. Uh, the contribution has been received by the minister in charge, and I'll be talking to you guys. You'll get to know all the details. The pictures will come through, and everything. God bless and may he bless all the hands that have donated in this period. Cheers.